Hi guys, welcome to DP Kids. Today we are going to talk about how to wrap a baby. So I've got Sterling here who is my little model and we're going to practice on him before we get too big to be wrapped. Hey! <laughs> so the first thing that I wanted to quickly mention is safe sleeping for babies. The best thing to do is head over to rednose.com.au they um, have the guidelines for what is safe in Australia for sleeping babies. They also have research and information um, to prevent sudden infant, de sudden infant death syndrome and the best way to do that in your home. They also have some articles about safe wrapping. Alternatively, you can go to my blog, which is www.dpkids.wordpress.com and I've also written a blog and there's some links as well in there, as well as some photos. So, the first thing we should ask is, why do we wrap babies? We wrap babies because it helps them feel safe and secure while they're sleeping, just like when they're in their mummy's tummies. And it also helps prevent the startle reflex. You may notice that your baby startles their arms like this quite often in their sleep or sometimes even when they're lying awake. And that wakes them up. And unfortunately, babies keep their startle reflex until they're about three to four months old, which means for the first three to four months old, they could be constantly waking themselves up, which means you don't get a very good sleep. So we wrap our babies, we get their little arms and we wrap them across their bodies like this and that prevents them from startling and waking themselves up. So there's a few types of wraps you can use. There's ones that you can buy like this that have Velcro tabs in them which makes it pretty easy actually. You just lay them on there, do up the Velcro tabs, you're right. However, if you don't get a good tight wrap up the top the little arms poke up the top or what you can do is just get a muslin a sheet of muslin or cheesecloth like this and use that as a wrap I prefer using a bit of both really these ones are great my auntie made them for me for my first son and they're nice and big so it doesn't matter how big your baby gets you can still use them as you can see <laughs> Sterling likes to put everything in his mouth at the moment so that'll do for now so let's go and have a watch of me wrapping this little guy. So start with your wrap laid out in front of you with about 20 to 25 centimetres folded down at the top. Pick up your little one and lay them on top with their head above the wrap and their shoulders in line with the top of the wrap. Remove anything from around their neck there for safe sleeping. The first thing I do, I always start with the right arm. So taking the right arm, tuck it up under that fold and bring that fold down next to their bottom to make like a triangle shape and just give it a little tuck underneath. Then stretch out their arm to the top and over their body, making sure their arm's enclosed in that fold there and putting that fabric just underneath their bottom on the other side. Then you're going to repeat the same thing with the other side. So open up the fold, pop their arm in, take it down, make it into like a triangle shape, pop their arm to the top of the fold there, and then fold it over their bodies, tucking it in underneath and all the way around. So that's really all you need to do. Just with some of that loose fabric, I just give it a little twist and then I turn it around and tuck it around their body as well however you don't need to do that you can leave it laying down if you want most important thing make sure they've got room for their legs to move around and you're good to go the next type of wrap is quick and simple basically lay it out lay your bub on top with their head above the top line of the wrap i'll just pull these socks off here bit loose. Tuck the legs down into the pouch, connect the velcro dot from the right hand side to the middle, make sure Bubby's arm is down, pull it up over the shoulder, make sure the arm's going across the body, tuck it into the other side, do the same on the left hand side of Bub, up and over, velcro down, ready to go. Okay, so how did you go? Did you get your little one wrapped up nice and safe, ready for a good night's sleep? We'd love to see how you went. If you pop over to our Facebook page, which I'll leave a link below, and I'd like to see some photos of you wrapping your little one and, and 
a little report of how did they do? Did they sleep better last night or did they still keep you up? Anyway, have a great day. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.